manipulation. <laughs> For fuck's sake. Yes. I'm not saying anything. Okay, I'm saying anything. Make a decision. <laughs> Make the decision. Hello, everyone, and welcome to another episode of The Mindless Show. I'm your host, Bob Dinkle. What the damn it? <laughs> this is a question for size. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I thought you were a student. With a key? That's impossible. Hey, you don't know. Dead Bad boy. What? <laughs> My What's name's Quentin Tarantino. I mean Quentin Tarantino. The F is silent. The, the F is silent. Yeah, let's restart the show. Okay. But just for the sake of bloopers. <laughs> there you have one. Okay, ready. Alright, let's go back up. So hit the... That was a stupid one. You ready? That's a no. Car. Yes. Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of The Mindless Show. I'm your host Bob Dinkle. This is my co-host. Barry Barry. Barry. Barry Barry. And our special guest today is... Quentin Tarantino. The F is silent. Quentin Tarantino. Yes. And then I hate saying that for the rest of my life. Yes. Now, today's topics is comics. Alright. Who wants to start off? I know, I make it look like a question show, but it's really just a talk show. Oh, just talk about comics. Superheroes within comics. Well, that's usually the case. The most conventional form of comic, is it not? Well, it's the most famous form of comic. It's not the only form of comic. Oh, yeah. I no. personally read comics like no Walking shit. Dead, for example. Yes. There's, yeah. There's, but, but I think... Because obviously comics did just evolve from uh, superheroes. Yes, it really did. Yeah. And now it's evolved into so many different types. Have you guys read comics? They're so good. What's your favourite comic? Wait, what you would you it? think... <laughs> okay, obviously the first comic was Superman and Beard, whether you hate him or not. That was the... Oh, wait. It was the action comics, though. Yeah, action But he comics. was the first one in the action comics, yeah. yeah. But what do you think the purpose behind it was? Superman? I mean, not... Or like not the action comic. Or just, like, just, just starting comics, like, as a platform, as a thing. As a media. Yes. Um, oh... You guys I, probably think? Would, I think we would have started from long ago because um yeah way long ago but they already like started engraving you know yeah. how images and wasn't that uh, post like words wasn't that post World War One or World War Two because I'm not entirely sure I mean the, that behind my point is it was all about that I think, like oh, yeah. Superman might be trying to reinforce like the mm. American spirit or whatever I, def I definitely Maybe. think it would be trying to reinforce Actually, yeah that. so what I, I think it might have been. Because obviously propaganda existed before, so yeah. technically comics in a way did exist in the form of propaganda. Mm. And technically yeah. that's what yeah. comics, they yeah. started off that way. Like they started as little tidbits and like yeah. newspapers. And even the action comics, like the, the Superman, for example, was I'm very sure he yeah, started off very, as propaganda, yeah. saying like Americans can be strong, they can be, you know, all this kind of yeah. stuff. I don't think he was an alien at first. I think he was just a guy with super strength and who could fly. Yeah. Hmm. yeah. I'm pretty sure he could only jump really high at the start. He couldn't yeah, fly. Yeah. He couldn't fly. He could leave tall um, buildings in a single bound. Comics in that yes. had actually had trouble within the World War II area because before yeah. they started, it used to be about fighting in that. So yeah. they had to sort of dial that down yeah. and to more comedic-ish yeah. to like calm everyone down from yeah, the war Yeah, because they didn't want to get too dark. But yeah. there, was, there was some points where there's comics where literally Captain America and Superman, they just punch Hitler. They just, they just, their main mission is to go and find Hitler and just punch him. Yep. Yeah, that was just, it was just like, um... It's like, you found Hitler, you, you did it, you, you beat World War Two. Yeah. Because you're fucking Superman. It was just like, there was the, like, Donald Duck cartoons that were literally oh, yeah. just he at, goes and, like, kills Hitler or something like yeah. that. Yeah, it's like... It just makes a big fool out of it. I'm pretty sure it was one that Donald Duck was Hitler, I mean, not himself. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let's not talk about this. So, comics. <laughs> um, I think we should talk about uh, indie comics. Okay. Because that... Obviously, like, I, I didn't really know about indie anything until probably, I guess, indie games when I started going on Would Steam. Would indie so... comics more fall on to just graphic novels, though? Because um, graphic novels, it, it's, it's like a, it's a form of book. It's not one genre. It's like every genre. Yeah. 
I, I guess. Like, like you I, previously mentioned, The Walking Dead, or it could just be some weird Chinese chick talking about her life living in an apartment in New York. It could just be as bad. as vague as that, yeah. Can you not? Yeah, they'll, they'll walk away. I'm watching the shadows at the door. Um, hold on a second. You guys continue. I usually mainly read. You know it's the red lights on. We're recording here. Jeez. Yeah, sorry. This is just a Rube Goldberg machine, isn't it? Yes, it is. <laughs> because everyone needs the cameras. But they, if they're going to get the cameras, they can fuck off. Well, yeah, just... We have permission for this room. We do. Oh, is this like the white... Look at the light, you retard. The light, you retard. <sighs> what should we do? Not do anything. Let's just piss them off. Okay. It's just, you can't. The they knocking is background sound. They can't the open the door, can they? No, they can't. Exactly. And even if they go ask Emma, she's, she does have the key, yes, but she has given us uh, direct permission to stay in here yeah. and no one else can. Yeah. You really think that's gonna work, right? I think I'll really just like wait out there for now. Yeah, that probably will. Um, okay, let's continue. So yeah. I don't so, read many indie comics, so I don't know me. No, I didn't read many indie comics either. Like mm -hmm. I probably read just well bigger comics because I know of them. Like there's one indie comic that I really want to get because it looks like it has some kind of Illuminati reference. But mm -hmm. that's that's just I think it's called the Entity of All Things, mm -hmm. and I haven't read it. I think it's just like the one graphic novel. It's got maybe two hundred pages or something, but it's specific we have to stories. Deal with this I turn the camera, but I don't want it. Hello, Captain Retards. What would you like? Uh, I need to go to the emissary to come and edit over here. And, uh, that's very nice. That was easy to have with me. Wait, are you sure Emma did? Because she told me that... She told me specifically that no one is allowed in here except for us. Yeah, no, that's, that's fair enough. Yeah, so... Obviously, Emma forgot the fact... <laughs> forgot her rule. That's funny. I, I found it funny. Ugh... <sighs> We shouldn't record it last time. I mainly read manga over the comics. Like, I do like comics. Oh, and yes, that. manga. I forgot about that. So, it yeah, because manga is Japanese for comics, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, basically. And, yeah, because my parents are going to Japan uh, later this year, and they literally, the, the one thing Dad asked was, like, what do you want us to get for you when we go to Japan? I'm like, get Sex me. Dolls. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's too easy. Um, I said, get me, like, an original, like, Dragon Ball comic. Like, even if it's in, even if it's in Japanese, which it probably will be. I don't care, because it will be it'll be an actual like Japanese manga. I'd be fine with that. Yeah, you realize you can just ignore them, right? I can't. <laughs> it's, like, just, it's like I can't not ignore it's, them. I'm fucking hard right now, dude. <laughs> <laughs> like look at him. Just amazing. Considering you're throwing that clock at us. Why do we have a clock? Why do we have a clock? Why don't we have a clock? Well, it's not even in shot, so we don't have oh, a clock. Oh, Wait, now we do. Clock twists are everywhere. Clock twist. Clock dun, dun, dun. twist. Because the clock twist is like a double pun. I'm going to shut it now. <laughs> because explaining jokes doesn't make it any more fun. Uh, I kind of feel like the vague topic of comics is is just... It's not really vague, it's just too... There's too much... Du we need to be more direct with it. Like, I want to specifically not talk about, especially comic book films and Marvel and DC, but yeah. around that. Like, for example, um... Because uh, obviously comic books are becoming films more often. Yes. And if there's any favourites I have of comic book films that aren't Marvel and DC, it's got to be Sin City. Yeah, Sin City definitely works. Sin but City is... I never watched brilliant. the sequel because apparently it was terrible, but it's not, I wouldn't know. I, I've watched it. I've watched them both in Blu-ray. I watched them both actually this weekend yeah. in Blu-ray, and they're good. Like, mm. Sin City, the first one, is so much better. Mm. The second one is... It's... Uh, it's not as yeah. good, but like, it's still worth a watch. Have you seen the, the spirit? It's sort of like the same as Sin City, just complete different story, and the art style is relatively the same within the movie. Uh, no, I've heard of it, but I, I haven't actually read or watched yeah. it. Or it's like all in black and white, and sort of like Sin City, but with specific things in colour. Yeah. Like his red converse shit. Yeah, so like yeah. Sin City. So yeah. he's a, like a ninja. Like a ninja. Like a ninja. 1940s ninja with the tie, and he's a investigator okay. in, the, in the mask and he's essentially Zorro with Converse shoes. 
I think okay. I might have seen that, but like ages ago. Yeah, it wasn't even really that great, but still. I think I feel, I feel like we just can't not talk about Marvel. No, like especially, or DC. especially or DC. Yeah, well, mm. well, not really. Like I, I this comics. Ooh. I gotta say, what about I hate One that detective. detective comics comics DC comics mm. detective comic comics. That was. Oh my god, I wonder if they realised how stupid their name was when they published it. Like, oh, let's go DC Comics, because it's Detective Comics. Com oh, shit, what have we done? Uh, bravo to DC. They probably just assume people would just go Detective Comics, so I just thought... Yeah, because that was what it was originally called, yeah. and then they just put it together. I don't even know why. Like, some kind of branding issue, maybe? I don't know. Maybe, but it's just branding. Yeah. Um, what other comics? What is the most, like... Just ridiculous comic plot you've ever heard of, and fit within mm. full under Marvel or DC or wherever it may be. But it's just absolutely ridiculous and stupid. But we won't go to the lengths of like hentai but, or tentacle porn. No, that's <laughs> obvious. It's like no, because that's good. Yes. <laughs> uh, wow. I don't. I don't know. I've I've read too many plot lines to mm. really. It's just all mixes into one all in right. my head. Well, have you ever heard of when Spider-Man? He apparently. Mm. He does the do with Mary Jane, try and make a baby, put the buns in the oven. And <laughs> throughout the process, you know, how he got bitten by a radioactive spider, that in turn created radioactive semen and killed his wife. And in turn killed his child. Oh, wow. I've, I've read it. It's a really weird comic, but Spider-Man kills Mary Jane with, with his, his semen. <laughs> yes. <laughs> And I, thought, I, I thought the fact that they him. made literally an Illuminati in, in the comics. Yeah. I thought that was fucked up. Yeah. That's fucked up. Yeah, but sometimes the Illuminati is uh, within like comic or just any plot line, just like shove and says like the, the mystery dudes behind yeah. behind the scenes doing all the things. Like I remember playing, I know it's a bit off topic, but Deus Ex Human Revolution. Mm. Then they introduce this like the Illuminati. It's like, you fucking serious? What? This is yeah. the cheapest shit I've ever heard of. Yeah. The Illuminati. Because no one knows the real Illuminati if they are real, so it can just essentially be fucking anything anyone thinks. Yeah, of. it could be us. <laughs> How's it going, Barry? Could be us. <laughs> I don't know. Like I read one comic of Spider-Man, which I don't I kind of. It was okay, but it kind of annoyed me the storyline because um Doctor Octopus he transferred his mind into Spider-Man. Oh yes, yes. Uh, I did see that. That's, Except, a, that's a classic. Yeah, that yeah. my personal. Oh, me personally, I just find um.